In northern Wisconsin, site boss Mike Zurakov has called an important meeting, 75 feet in the air. The reason we're having this meeting is this is a very dangerous place to work. It's not one or two or three things we have to watch out for. It's dozens of things we have to watch out for. Today, we're holding a safety meeting. I think people have been getting a little bit too relaxed about some, some right ways to do things and right ways to stay safe. And they're going to hear it again, even though they've heard it before. This building was put up in 1887. If you look behind you, you'll see a piece of roof that's already collapsed without anyone even walking on it. It's just a hole where there used to be roof. If you fall through this floor, you're going down 75 feet. It's enough to flatten your head like an egg. He's going over a lot of stuff. Um, damn near fall asleep during these safety meetings. To give you an idea of what happens, let's walk over here and I'll introduce Yeah, I'm very serious. This is our newest guy. Because I know they've heard all this stuff before, decide to bring in a little help. All right, guys, meet Safety Sam. Hi, Safe. How you doing? Safety Sam is going to do a demonstration for us. Right. He has volunteered to sacrifice it all for our edification. Now, Safety does not have a fall harness on. That's a mistake, because he's standing right near an opening. And he's all dressed up, hard hat and everything. Safety first. Oh, Safety, you're going to wish you had your harness on, man. Grab him, Mike. Get him, Mike. Safety <laughs> was leaning out the window. He was looking at something upstairs, see? And he forgot he had no harness on. So what happened? He lost his balance! Ah! Holy <laughs> Sam took a bad fall. like a game of Plinko, just like I figured. Everybody saw what happened to Sam? That could happen to you when you fall through a window or an opening or off the edge. So let's remember Sam and stay safe. I don't have time for funerals. Let's get to work. This is a dangerous place, and I try to impress on the guys that, because after a while, you just get accustomed to it. If you work in a dangerous place every day, it's very easy to just kind of forget about it. It becomes like the wallpaper. It, I'm trying to prevent that by constantly reminding, but the demonstration really was better than just reminding. <laughs> 